One evening after school, George was playing in the garden. Elisa was reading a book in the living room with her mom. Mom was talking over the phone. Yes, Mrs. Peterson. Elisa and George also like the chocolate cake. I usually get it from the local bakery near the new toy shop. Mom, I am hungry. I want some cookies. George, I am on an important call. Could you please wait for five minutes? No, I want the cookies right now. Elisa, can you please go and stop George? He cannot get the cookies by himself. Sorry, Mrs. Peterson. That was George. George looked at the cookie box on the fridge. Mmm, the chocolate chip cookies look delicious. Let me get the cookie box. I am a big boy now. I can grab it by myself. George could not reach the box. It was too high. George rose and stood on his toes. He could not still reach the box. George jumped high to get the cookies. But the box seemed higher. George, wait. Wait for mom. George did not wait. He dragged the chair and stood over the chair. George tried to reach the box, but hey, the cookie box was still out of reach for George. George, stop! You will hurt yourself. George now jumped from the chair to get the cookie box. You must stop this, George. You are too small for this. You might lose your balance. George did not listen. Oh yes, I have an idea. George went to the garden, got a stick and ran back to the kitchen. He hopped onto the chair and tried to get the cookie box using the stick. Oh dear! George lost his balance and fell to the ground. He even dropped the cookie box. Cookies all over the floor in the kitchen. Oh no! George started crying. Mom ran towards the kitchen and she hugged George. They are gone. I even dropped the box. <laughs> Don't worry, George. Are you hurt as well? Just a bit. Chair on my elbow. Oh, my dear. You will be fine. You are a brave boy. Let us get some cookies for you from the market. Lisa and George went to the market with mom to get some cookies. I will always listen to mom. <laughs>